good evening mr shubham you, this is your second mock interview you are appearing good for evening, which which interview are you appearing sir i'm appearing for nicl ao for it rule acha nicl ao but it yeah. rule yes for it specialist it specialist good excellent now can you tell me what are the languages you studied while studying in college while studying in college i studied java and c okay good now after that when did you complete your degree sir i completed my degree in 2022 acha good after that were you employed somewhere i currently am working in open test organization as a cloud devops engineer acha good where is that company and uh, so that company is in bangalore sir acha so you are now staying in bengaluru yes sir you are a native of which place sir i am native of bihar how do you manage See? for local communication and all aapko to kannad nahi jante hain how are you managing yes sir sir yeah. here i think so. i think sir most of the people understand at least english and hindi also most of the people understand so we we won't face that much of communication gap here acha theek hai where do you stay in bengaluru sir i am staying near indranagar 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 jayanagar all those things aas paas mein hoga na yes Nain. yes yeah yes aas paas hi but i i remember to have heard those names when i visited uh, um say your place you know good okay okay sir now what have you prepared for this interview yes sir so i have gone through all the basics of insurance it and current affairs so now my interview day is approaching my interview is on 4th of october in kolkata west bengal so now mm -hmm. i have pretty much wrap up all wrapped up all the things thank you but can you tell me why insurance what is the benefit for insurance companies that insurance insurance is beneficial for the people because first it's a, it it covers the risk it gives the risk coverage to the people second so it also gives peace of mind if if something is insured then then people can stay relaxed regarding the future mishap which can happen sir it also gives a financial stability and sir it gives protection against against the property or any any losses due to any reason which is going to happen so this for what this you, all, all what do you know about the regulatory authority of uh, insurance sir irda i uh, regulates general insurance and life insurance company of india and irda has been set up, has been uh, settled in 1999 through the general business insurance regulation act so what is what is the main function sir the main function of irdi is to regulate and streamline the general insurance and life insurance companies of india to to protect the interest of policy holders to make to make insurance viable and reachable to all the sections of society and I, irdi has a motto Uh, that uh, insurance for all up to twenty forty seven. But now, in um, insurance companies, uh, which type of communication is used? Is it point to point communication or multi point connection? Which type of connections are used? Uh, I'm I'm not sure about the answer. But sir, I think multi, sir, multi point connection, multi point connection, multi point. Yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Now, what do you know about network topology? So, network topology is a connection between various nodes, which are which are there in the network. So, there are there are various types of network topology. So, just like star topology, tree topology, bus topology, mesh topology. So, these all are the methods of topology. and topology is the uh, topology is basically the methods in which all the nodes in a network are connected there is one more known as tree topology yes sir tree topology is there sir 
but that is okay now you are working in an it company yes sir how many people are working in your company in my company my company holds sir 10000 employees sir wow bre 10000 employees yes sir yes. sir the company yes. company is situated But, in canada and uh, oh what is the name of the company the, sir the name of the company is open text open text oh oh Open text Waterloo. Yes. Open sir. text. Open text carriers. Yes, sir. Open text Waterloo. They have yes, offices. Sir. They have offices in um, probably Canada, Philippines, Germany, Ireland, U.S. and all these places. Correct. Yes, yeah, sir. In India, sir. Bangalore and Hyderabad, sir. These two so places. So what is? Uh, what is it they are doing in their company sir open text is one of the biggest information technology um, brand and sir it gives very it, it has various products based on the clouds apart from that it also manages database information security cyber security and it has various products which which provides various service to the customers acha good and now what is the nature of work you are doing now in that company okay so currently here here currently i am devops engineer and i am working on the cloud so basically i works on a gcp and azure and i i deploy i prepare the infrastructure on the top of that infrastructure is known as cloud toolkit and and on the top of that infrastructure the products get deployed so our work is mainly to manage all the infrastructure part what is infrastructure so infrastructure is the amalgamation of community server storage database uh, mount point uh, these all the network network virtual private network so these all things make up infrastructure and our work is to streamline streamline the process so that each resource can talk with other resource just like database can provide service to servers data from database we can extract the information so managing all this infra is our is our currently work uh, in the devops mm -hmm. now what are the problems you face uh, in your um, networks that uh, is uh, what sir. type of problem you are uh, solving the problems of customers or are you taking care of some network of some customers sir currently currently sir we are not directly facing the customer one team is there which is facing the customer and they give us the requirement of the customer so whatever requirement comes from the customer side we deal we work on that requirement so basically whatever requirement comes from the customer side we work on that requirements mm -hmm. can you tell me what is control plus b the ctr control plus b is used for paste options sir so pasting of the uh, pasting not, of the not, copied things i am i am not asking b control plus b b for bombay okay okay control plus b sir it is it is used to make the letters bold so good for that so what is, is it is very good what is control plus e e for england okay sir uh, control plus e sir currently i am not able to recall sir control plus e uh, aligns the line or selected text to the center of the screen okay okay sir Al okay. aligns the line or selected text to the center of the screen okay sir the, okay i will try to read about they, it they they will not ask about all these things but still now what yes. are the achievements you have made in your present company sir uh, 
okay and sir in present companies some days ago we got the requirement uh, to to streamline the infrastructure on gcp google cloud so google cloud was very new for us so we we went through some training and seminars and after that we came to to learn the google cloud and using google cloud now we have we, we have developed a server a database and a storage account so we have streamlined all the networks and server on the google cloud and now product team are using our our infrastructure to deploy their resources so this is one of how the you, recent uh, how will you define a bug sir sir a, a bug can be defined as any anything which is hampering our task which is hampering our work in the network can be termed as a, a, a bug or it it can be related to the code itself so anything uh, which which uh, preventing us from getting the intended result is termed as a bug no, what you said is okay but you are not using the catch word a bug yes, is sir. an error is an error yes sir yes sir it is a flaw or failure yes. or fault a sub one of these words you must use because those are catch words okay sir what is cache memory sir, sir uh, cache memory is temporarily storing the information to to uh, means it is it is available there it is the quickest memory available there and in that cache memory all the all the temporary data are stored there so when we search for something or we fetch for something so if it is present in cache then it is getting automatically retrieved from there what is a client server sir sir client sir there are two models of architecture peer to peer and client server so client server is a centralized technique in which one server is there and various client clients are there attached to that uh, to that server so this uh, this is one of the network this is one of the network architecture sir what is clock rate uh, sir clock rate, clock rate you know clock rate you don't remember the clock rate sir currently i i didn't remember but i have i have uh, studied in it the past it is a fundamental sir. fundamental rate in cycles per second measured yes. in hertz at which a computer performs its most basic operations such as adding two numbers or transferring a value from one processor register to another Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Very good. Now, why should we give preference to you? Okay, sir. Tell okay. Me. Yeah. So, uh, sir, uh, sir, I think, sir, I, I am a team player. So, I likes to work in the team. Sir, apart from that, sir, I am optimistic and energetic person. So, I try to keep the environment optimistic, so that, so that the the thing which which we are working on gives us the uh, fruitful result. Its efficiency should be high. Apart from, sir, I as I can also I can also control. I I, I have worked in the certain for some uh, less period. but whatever experience i have gained through in my life till now i can somehow contribute to uh, contribute to my work how do you define a firewall sir a fire sir a firewall is basically there to to control the network traffic so it it either prevents the, the incoming network and outgoing uh, it incoming traffic and outgoing traffic so it is there to control the network traffic mm mm-hmm. mm yeah okay good now that one you managed well now what is a freeware freeware okay sir yes sir uh, sir freeware sir i have studied but currently sir i am not able to recall freeware so. means a software distribution where the author retains copyright of the software but makes the program available to others at no cost okay Can you follow okay sir yes sir yes sir very good uh now one minute let me go for some it related questions it related questions i think i have given you na 
Yes, sir. Really, you have given me some questions. Hmm. What is an application gateway? Sir, application gateway is basically load balancer. So it is used to manage and distributes the load coming on the network. And so it, it distributes the load based on certain condition. So it, it helps helps to, to, to make the traffic streamlined. In this way, sir, it, it helps. What is the difference between HTTP and HTTPS? HTTP stands for Hyper Transfer Transport Transfer Protocol, and HTTP stands for Secure. Their Secure is there. So HTTP is more secure than HTTP. So in HTTPS, we are using TLS or SSL method. So it is and it, it, it encrypts the net data in the network. So it is it is more secure form than the HTTP. Good. Then. What do you know about DDoS attack? So DDoS attack stands for distributed denial of service attack. And so this happens when a lot of, lot of requests come, comes to the server. So that, that, that request is a false request based on some botnets. And so then this request comes in a very huge quantity and server server become very busy and server won't be able to respond to some 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 needy or useful useful request so it is in this attack server gets busy and it won't it won't respond to some useful request so in this manner what sorry, is, it hampers our work what is dmz Sir, DMZ sir, stands for sir, Demilitarized Zone, uh, and sir, it, it, it is the it, uh, it is the part of part in the it is it is just some helpful practice currently, and sir, exactly I am uh, not able to pinpoint what what it is, but I have studied it. It is Demilitarized Zones, and it is uh, um, it is some part of the code, sir. So this only can I recall now, sir. Describe the software development process in brief. Sir, it's, it's a software development life cycle is the process of designing and maintaining the software uh, software from the root to the to the final level. And so it consists of various steps. So it one of the steps is uh, requirement analysis is the first step. Then uh, we have um, planning. Then we have uh, design. Then we have development. Then we have maintenance. Then we have testing. So a uh, software goes through where to, so software goes through the all uh, process and at finally uh, software gets uh, developed. What are the different SDLC models you are familiar with? So there are different types of SDLC models based on the different needs. So waterfall models are there, iterative model are there, spiral model are there, red model are there. So in this way, sir, there are various models. A prototype model is there. So these uh, models are there. Based on our requirements, we, we, we prefer these types of models. Which one is you, you are more using more in your day-to-day -day work? Uh, currently, currently, I'm using Agile model in day-to-day -day work more, sir. Yeah, I think that is the best. Agile model is the best, it seems. Yes, sir. It's based on the customer Very, requirements. It, yeah. it can change to customer requirement. Have you heard of waterfall method? Yes, sir. I have heard of waterfall me method, sir. So it is an iterative type of method, sir. Uh, and it is generally used when our project size is small. So it is a type of iterative method. So we go through each step one by one. And so uh, until the previous steps gets completed, we can't proceed to the further steps. What is software prototyping and POC? OK, uh, sir, software prototyping. In this, sir, we create a prototype of software. So before designing the software, we create a dummy prototype, means exact functioning of the software. And we test various scenario that on that prototype that whether using the on the same same level and same scale, if we create the software, that would be useful or efficient or not. So it is a dummy of software, we can say, and we can create it for testing, for various testing, sir.
what is SRS? Sir, SRS tends to tends to sir software requirement specification. So it is a specification given by the clients, uh, and that which type of uh, software they they want and they need. Yeah. Okay, but here it is given differently. SRS is a formal report that serves as a representation of software that allows yes, customers to assess whether it meets their needs. It's okay, more or less, you carried basic important points. Good. What is case tools? Case tools. Uh, case tools. Um, or collection of software application programs that okay, automatic sir. SDLC tasks. Analysis tools, okay. design tools, project management tools, database management tools, documentation tools, or a few of the case tools available to simplify various stages of software development cycle. Correct? Okay, sir. Okay, yes, sir. Good. What is a black box testing and a white box testing? Sir, in black box testing, sir, basically we test test the functionality. We test the all the all the huge case, whether all the huge case are passing or not, and it is basically done by the tester. So, and sir, in white box testing, we 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 go through the implementation of the code, and it is basically done by the developer. So, in glass 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 box testing. Uh, we can go through the all the codes part whether it is it is optimized it is efficient or not and it is done by developer have you heard of the term yes core banking solution yes sir i have heard the term sir code banking solution sir sir code sir, code banking okay yeah. sir what sir, is the code banking, banking Okay, so code banking solution basically provides the the back, the background the the background of whatever um, going in the bank. So it manages your database, your it streamlines the task, it maintains the information, it maintains the soft copy. So currently there are many many companies just like said TCS Bank is one of the company which is providing their code banking solution. So it is the what is it is, it is the background. What is uh, what is raw shady? Uh, sir, row chaining. Yeah. Sir, row chaining, sir. Currently, I need to read about this sir. row chaining. It is there. Question number 94 in the material given to you. Okay, sir. What is a data dictionary? Sir, data dictionary basically uh, stores, uh, sir, all the all the mappings to the of the of the data, sir. So basically, it, is, it stores the mapping to the data, and we can refer to the data dictionary for the information. What is the difference between digital signature and digital certificate? The digital, the digital certificate basically we, we do to provide valid, validation to the piece of paper that uh, this is certified, uh, or, or digital certificate can be used from a person uh, per, person side. And sir, second thing, sir, what you have, sir, digital, digital, apart from digital, digital okay. signature. Okay, so this, uh, digital signature is for sorry, sir, digital signature is for the person's behalf that uh, that this document is valid and it it has been authorized. But uh, that uh, digital certificate used for use can be used for any programs, any softwares that uh, it is licensed and it is valid one. Please tell me some. Three current affair news you remember? Sir, currently, sir, very current affairs and uh, sir, currently, sir, war is not war. Sir, Israel has uh, a strike, a strike on Beirut, uh, which is in Lebanon, and sir, the the leader of uh, Hezbollah uh, has been killed. Um, so this is one of the news uh, which which I came through. So a part of this, sir, what, main... what is the news in Bihar? Uh, sir, currently. Currently, uh, currently in Bihar, sir. Um, currently in Bihar. Or news in, in B... Karnataka. Okay, sir. Sir, in Karnataka, sir, one of the case which is going on, sir, that is uh, that is here. 
here sir parliamentary affairs minister has denied the cbi to to investigate the matter of muda which is which is related to sidharamaiya in which it is it is it has been told that he has gifted the, some uh, he has gifted some projects mysore urban development authority to on the name of his wife so this is one of the heated thing which is currently going on in uh, karnataka sir governor governor has given permission na yes the governor has given permission uh, but this uh, minister uh, this minister of law has has uh, taken the uh, take, uh, taken the approval which which has been given to cbi earlier oh it has been drawn there is approval yes. given to cbi very good excellent yeah. who is the it minister in the central government information the it minister Sir, IT minister in the central government is Mr. S. Asni Bashnav, sir. Very good. Best wishes. Today, what is your name? Uh, sir, my name is Subham. Most probably, you will be selected. Read very you, much sir. more well. Prepare about your company also. Prepare about national insurance company also. Go with confidence. I am sure you must get selected. Please send the questions they are asking you. Okay, sir. Okay. Uh, there is no reason why they should not select you because I have seen questions from different areas and you have been managing it very well, excepting 10% questions you could not answer. That is okay. No problem. Best wishes. God Thank bless you. you. I wish you success. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I wish you should come and Inform that you have been selected. God bless you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.